It doesn't bother me at all. I haven't noticed it since I left. So it's a congenital heart block. Uh, my mother-in-law, who passed away three years ago, she had 27 pacemakers. Three out of four of our kids have partial blocks. So Sam is very interesting in that his family has a condition called acquired heart block, and it's a familial condition. We can see that on his electrocardiogram that the upper chamber is starting to talk to the lower chamber in a, in a difficult way. The communication is getting a little bit longer. It's getting a little bit more difficult to communicate between the upper and lower chamber of the heart. And we expect that one of these days that will stop. And what we're concerned about is that could stop abruptly and he could faint or have even more serious consequences as a result. And so because of that, our desire was to put a pacemaker before he reached that stage. You know, of course it was hard to hear and just had to do it, but we felt much better that it was in knowing that he was safe. This new pacemaker, the Medtronic Micra, has uh, just been released recently. And what that is, is it's a, it's a pacemaker that's, that's the size of a, of, a, of a pill capsule, basically. And that pacemaker itself is inserted directly in the heart. There's no wires. The, the entire pacemaker itself is all self-contained within that small capsule. That's put in from the vein at the top of the leg. We go up to the heart we put it into the heart and it's held into the heart with little tines, little little wires that hold it into place in the heart. And it does all the same function of the pacemaker, all condensed into that one little, into that one little apparatus. It's pretty cool. It's, uh, I mean, it's small. It's very gratifying to see patients doing well, especially after a new procedure. Sam's mom had sent me pictures of him on the baseball diamond not long after his procedure, and he was back to his usual activities really very, very quickly. With the standard pacemaker, even though it's small, there's a small scar over the chest. Every time you look in the mirror, you are reminded of the fact that you have a pacemaker and that you're sick. In this instance, there's no reminder. There's no scars. Um, there's nothing to remind you that you actually have anything wrong with you at all. And I think from a psychological standpoint, it does make a difference. You realize that life's short and you really got to make sure that you're not just sitting around saying, oh, sick, poor, uh, so whatever, that you're actually having fun. We were going through caves, swimming in caves, and they said, you know, does anybody have any heart conditions? Anybody? These two were, were dove into the cave sooner than anybody. <laughs> so, so, I mean, it's, it's uh right i don't think it slowed us down